All right, so what we're gonna be doing today is trying the new NB miner uh, with a 3070 Ti to check out what kind of hash rate we can get. So we're gonna try stock settings at this point and then we'll do an overclock after. So it looks like just completely stock, looking at about 47 and a half hash, mining ETH. We'll let it go one more time here just to see if it's uh, around that same amount. Ah, it jumped up a bit, almost 50 at this point. We'll let it go one more time here just to get a Good idea. That's about fifty. Now, for our overclock settings, uh, I'm just gonna use the sliders because I'm not uh, not the best at doing it uh, the other way. Uh, so I have these set at a 70% power limit, uh, minus 500 on the core clock, and then maxed out on memory clock. And then I like to run my fans pretty high just so I keep my card low. So I believe we should be getting about 57 to 60, give or take. Yep, 58.85. I've played around with the uh, overclock settings quite a bit and I find that uh, 70 on the power limit Puts you at about 210 to 215 watts, and you're still getting close to 60 hash. So, I mean, it's not terrible. It's definitely a lot better than when the 3070 Ti originally came out. Yeah, so we're basically about 58. I'm sure there are ways to get, uh, you know, a little bit higher. Um, I'm pretty content at this hash rate with this amount of watts. I am going to be picking up a 3080 Ti and I'm going to run the same uh, same type of video just to kind of get an idea on what we can get with that card as well. Feel free to uh, leave some comments and if I have, uh, you know, if you guys want to see other cards, let me know. I have quite a few I can put on here and we can have a look.